Hey guys, welcome back to another phone comparison video and today we will be doing a detailed comparison between the OnePlus 3 and the Huawei Nexus P. Alright guys, so in case you have missed to watch the OnePlus 3 in specific videos like unboxing, 4G video samples and detailed camera review like in all daytime, nighttime, indoor order, whatever you can think of in possible conditions. I've shown you a lot of videos to make sure to follow and subscribe me and watch all this video. So I'll put the link in the show window. So both of these devices are running latest Android Marshmallow 6.0.1 and so before we begin guys, let's do a quick recap on the specs wise. So here are the Nexus 6P specs. And here are the OnePlus 3 specs too. So guys, uh, uh, it's pretty shocking like you know you must be uh, it's a whopping 6 gigs of RAM but let me give you guys a bad news here in case you don't know. So OnePlus 3 won't use all 6 gigabytes of RAM by default. Alright guys, so uh, there's a lot of buzz going on like people are saying uh, even though it has 6 gigs of RAM but still uh, it sometimes get lag and even I did notice that too guys because sometimes uh, when I try to uh, open some notifications and open an app any notification base so I see like uh, there's slight delay and in terms of camera also too since I have taken more than 300 pics right now so when I try to switch sometimes between HDR mode to HD or uh, the dynamic D mode and HDR plus so sometimes I get see like it's uh, 10 seconds slow so I get surprised like what are the sense of having 6 gigs of RAM guys so there is an answer from the OnePlus CEO uh, this Carl Pay and that's because the OnePlus 3 is throttled to use just a portion of RAM. It is an effort to save battery life. Its 3000 mAh battery lasts a lot longer with this restriction in place and result is a better user experience. So just by giving the name better user experience, you might be just going on the numbers on the paper and buy this and bought a phone with 6 gigabytes of RAM and doesn't shows. And I think personally it gives you at least 4 gigs of RAM. Uh, 2 gigs might be not available. So uh, just on the number and see it shows 6 gigabytes. Even you run any device specific software it will say show you guys the 6 gigabytes of RAM but it's not going to give you. So it's fine to guys. So let's begin guys. Uh, we begin our test here and forgetting all this thing here so nexus 6p is my personal device i uh, love it with many reasons like good camera good display a great sound with two front firing speakers fastest android update and latest android and preview deputy uh, 4 bit so make sure to watch these videos too and simple and fast device guys but i when i start using one plus three i kind of started like that because the way it feels me guys this is you know just show you guys the difference here this is 5.7 inch this is 5.5 inch you can see how much is size difference and in terms of thickness and weight and everything else here this is so sleek guys i started loving this device and you know it's very nice and even when i was testing the camera guys i do find that it's a very good camera it's not that bad too i mean sometimes even it takes better picture than 6p so a lot of good stuff there in 6p so make sure to watch this camera video so uh, just the thing left with me is uh, only this performance comparison so we will uh, begin with our test and uh, let's see so uh, right now we will do the seven tests like boot time test app launching games launching multitasking benchmarking test internet speed download test and the shutdown time so both devices are powered off and they are running the latest android marshmallow 6 so i'm just going to power them one together guys so let's see which one turns faster so powering down the devices in three two one both are running the closest stock this is pure stock this is you know the uh, os after you know uh, i guess this is second one which is closest one uh, and the, this uh, whatever you get in this uh, motorola devices now in the lenovo hold so they two are very close but it has doesn't it has nothing and no bloatware at all the motorola guys give you some motor assist but it doesn't give you anything you can see you guys which one boosts faster here so the ram shows effect here we get this uh, our things booting fast here even the fingerprint is so accurate it's the first time you need to enter that because uh, you have just uh, not used that so there you go guys the devices are booted up so in case you want this wallpaper you can get that on the facebook page i used to put all my apps wallpaper here and all other demos wallpaper there so we'll begin with a simple uh, guys uh, app launching test so first test uh, is passed by this one by actually the one plus three we'll start with simple as here so this is i will just launch feedly here launching feedly in three two one so it shows the one here but it shows the stuff later but uh, we can can sort of tie up here so we'll launch the twitter here so launching twitter in three two one so almost same so marshmallow is pretty good in the nexus 6p i guess yes so we we'll launch an instagram here so launching instagram in 
3, 2, 1. This one first here. So Chrome Beta launching Chrome Beta in 3, 2, 1. Definitely wins by 1 plus 3. So Google Drive launching Google Drive in 3, 2, 1. Almost same, uh, but here we can see the one plus three win here. So launch a file manager. So launching file manager in three, two, one. A bit of margin, not much. So launching Google Keep in three, two, one. Uh, sort of here tied up, I can see here because it shows a turn on notification here. So launch the YouTube app here. So launching YouTube in three, two, one. So both of them launched almost same but this shows the uh, loads the result faster okay guys so we launch the play store here so launching play store in three two one you can see uh, almost similar or pretty much so just a fraction of difference nothing much it's not a way difference here so we launch camera so here i guess i know this uh, one plus is going to test win here because i tried a lot of times here so google camera versus uh, oxygen camera in three two three two can see here it's already launched here so but here yeah, they're surprising you guys did you see that so both of them laid out on the same place here but now this one shows you some red stuff here so what happened so hang up come on google so you can see here it shows a lot of red margin here maybe due to because of laser focus autos. anyway getting inside and so we launch our next app guys and we will launch here uh, adobe acrobat reader so launching adobe acrobat reader in three two one it's almost same and uh, no difference at all and uh, we'll launch again here our next app we launch the uh, games later here so uh, let me launch some other app here so we launch chrome here chrome beta we already tested and it's kind of tied up so launch it chrome in three two no need to save one and uh, google wins here the next is 6p uh, getting in here and uh, we launch the official clock let's see what is the clock app does so this icon looks nice in the oxygen os so launching clock in three two so you can see here uh, this uh, one plus three has a bit of a fraction of second advantage here so let's launch uh, google maps here so launching google maps in three two so pretty much one plus three has one here again so most of the apps we see here guys uh, one plus three is winning here almost many times here so we launch some other apps like whatsapp so launching whatsapp in three two one can see here i'll just do that thing here again uh, it's launching whatsapp again again in three two one so again uh, one plus three here got a title twitter we have already seen we we'll launch a true color here so launching a true color in three two you can see here this one comes much much faster so most of the things we are seeing and uh, next one plus three is giving a tougher job here i will launch one microsoft base app like uh, this uh, skype here so launching skype in three two one so you can see your nexus 6 we has slight advantage here so we'll go with uh, our new app it's called office lens another microsoft base app so launching office lens in three two see one plus three is much ahead so any other uh, things are left for us so we'll try for two games guys here and then we'll move to some multitasking stuff here so we'll launch a fun small game here so uh, almost i can say about 10 to uh, 10 if you open 10 apps so four apps so one by uh, you can see one nexus 6p and six by one plus three so uh, clearly nexus one uh, is uh, slightly behind the uh, uh, one plus three now you can see that Temporal in two in three two one complete seconds of difference, guys. Uh, I guess three to four seconds. So we'll do that test again. Uh, I want to see how much uh, so things are behind here. Launching temple into again. So launching temple run two in three two one. So both same time now. 
but that's surprising guys first time we saw here uh, it was too late here but this time they are almost same so i don't know it's maybe nice reason here uh, because uh, it's really good so we'll launch uh, this asphalt 8 here uh, launching asphalt 8 in 3 2 1 takes a bit of time in loading this one so I'm going to press the start race this time on both places so that's great guys you saw Nexus 6 we wins here this time so it's pretty much shocking I mean we launched the things here together but uh, it here comes here faster so uh, we already done this thing now we will do guys some uh, multitasking test and see like uh, how the apps resume and how much time they takes here so we got a lot of apps open you can see we open many bunch of number of apps here so we'll start with our first one we'll do a couple of them then games here so switching back to uh, Feedly in 3, 2, 1 so it uh, both tends to reload the data so anyway nothing worries about the both house same so we'll go to youtube app switching back to youtube in three two one this one loads faster and but it shows the result first that is more important so good job nexus now let's resume the temple into so resuming temple into in three two one this one loads slightly faster if i just uh, play and do a resume here so so almost same no worries we'll launch to some other one here say maps no maps not needed so we'll play a video and see guys uh, which one uh, does better in this one just going to guys uh, launch one of my app here one of my video here so i got one video here and right and depth preview four reviews i'm just going to click here so clicking on three two one both are the same network still going to the ATM still to going get your to bank balance to get your bank balance balance with balance, 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 balances with one nut so you see guys uh, nexus 6p loads the result first so looks like google apps are much better way optimized in this one here so anyways uh, we will do one more uh, switching here just to asphalt and see then we will uh, do some internet download test here so as launching asphalt 8 again or uh, resuming you can say resuming in 3 2 1 so this one resumes faster no problem so pretty much uh, uh, one plus three is giving more power showing more power here so we'll do guys one download test here we'll do a download test of this zombie dump Sally. so let's see not in three two one anyway it does takes uh, less time to stall guys but that's not an issue here so it depends on like which wi-fi network has been you know acquired much bandwidth before guys we'll do a quick bank uh, geek benchmark test guys i'm just going to rent here together so we'll see i will make a fast forward from here so you can see guys uh, the nexus sorry the one plus three shows it's a much faster that's how uh, sometimes uh, if you have more rams and higher processor these stuffs matter that time otherwise in day-to-day -day usage there's nothing as such here so 2360 is a single core score and because this has such a you know uh, the reasons are very uh, obvious because it got higher number of clock cycle you can see here it got 1.59 gigahertz and it's a really a very high number here that's why it may be the reason and even it's a cryo processor which does uh, sometimes get faster though you know uh, there's a cortex based processor and a single core score came here 2360 way higher to all the phones here nexus 6 galaxy x here and lot of phones here sitting on the top one here multi-core score is even though too higher 5419 here the nexus 6 taking a lot of time guys I
close result of uh, 69 is way way less here you can see you guys single core score is unmatchable it's definitely much higher here i mean it's uh, four times more here and it's twice double here so that's it for this one and let's launch guys this uh, into the benchmark test result here and we will just see here how much scores comes here So this are the previous result. I'm just going to show you guys again. Yeah, it's way, way much different. You can see it's, it's just exactly more than double. So I'm just going to run the test here again. So guys we got the result this time of the 7 plus 3 very fast here you can see just after 70% it moved to I don't know <laughs> so sh shocking here but anyway Nexus 6 is still running here and some sort of bug here guys I tried to run one here and was stuck at 70% now just immediately jumped to 72 I don't know completed 100% so anyway shows here the perfect result here it goes step by step here so So we are going to get back our result here and uh, looks like it got 50174 uh, compared to the this one you can see guys it's a huge huge difference and let me show you here where our this uh, this one is just sitting here just below the Lee Eco Max 2 and the Xiaomi uh, 5 here so they got here 136773 so not very high just a couple of hundreds or thousands of difference here and this one is just sitting right behind I don't know where it sets just sitting here the uh, above the Note 3 Mizu Note 3 M3 Note 3 so a lot of low here guys so uh, anyway guys this is the benchmarking test result here so just moving to the new step here that's it guys we have done a lot of tests and the final test evening we'll just do a, a shutdown test here. we'll see which device uh, a guest turns off first here so i'm just going to do a click power off here so i'm just going to click here i click on the power off three two one So there you go guys, a lot of things I have shown you, so make sure to watch all the, you can see, turned off much faster, all the camera reviews and a lot of 4Ks and stuff here, so uh, guys, it's nothing to be judged here, both devices are great here, so uh, for the stock Wessler, for the Android faster updates, so the Nexus 6 is obviously the number one choice here, and this one is a lot of customization there, there's no match to Nexus, there's no match to OnePlus, I love both devices, and that depends on you guys, everybody has different perspective and choice of requirement. So whatever device you like that, choose it wisely and all devices work perfectly. It just depends on the way how you use it, how much things you do it. So all devices are great. So hope you enjoyed this video guys and if I help you, uh, do hit the thumbs up button. Don't forget to subscribe to watch more. This is Sarabh and the scene guys. I'll talk to you very soon. Have a nice day ahead.